Hello again. If you're not sick of me, you obviously want to know about the runes. So we'll just jump right in and move to the next rune. The next rune is Rido. This is the fifth? No, sixth. Feurus Trisas Ansus Rido, fifth. I just had to check with me. Uh, Rido is the fifth in the first ad of, of the runic Futhark. Um, Futhark, by the way, is actually just the first six runes and their sounds. So we'll go ahead and jump down and get a look at Rido. Rido is, uh, its traditional meaning is the cart. It's about the journey. It's about moving along. It's not actually about being the driver of the cart. It's about being in the cart and enjoying the journey. Rido is all about um, your path ahead of you is not necessarily yours to choose step by step, but you need to learn along the way. It's not about it's not about the end. It's about the journey. It's about enjoying the journey. It's about learning along that path. Uh, Rido is very much about very much about allowing things to happen. Um, not necessarily being passive about it. Um, being reactionary reactionary is more along the lines. Rido tells you that if you are taking the trip simply because of the ends, you're on the wrong path. Um, if you're not enjoying the path itself, if, um, I'll use a specific spiritual example, if you're, if you've begun a spiritual path because you want what you get out of it in the end, all of the things that lead through initiation and dedication and mastery, those things are all going to be tedious chores and you're not going to be able to enjoy them. So this is what Rido's talking about, is if you're not enjoying the path, the end is not going to be nearly as sweet. Um, I, Rido is one of, the, one of the runes that I'm not so terribly familiar with that it speaks to me on a regular basis. So if any of you have any insight that I haven't shared here, uh, feel free to leave me a video response. We're going to go ahead and move on to the next one in the next video, but until then, Odin be with you.